All right, everybody, we are here outside of the South Hall of the Convention Center, and when you come to see us, you gotta see what BMW is cooking, and uh, my God, look at what they're cooking over here. This is their iX Flow, a paint, color changing paint car. Just take a, just, just, I need you all to kind of like absorb that for a moment. It's blowing my mind, everyone here, like this has got to be one of the things you absolutely have to see at CES. So, I'll, you know, I only know so much. I got to get a pro in here with me. So, Dr. Stella Clark here hey. um, works Hi. on this project, right? Exactly, yeah. This is amazing, okay? Thank you. Uh, Thank you. you guys should be freaking proud of this. Um, I yeah. just love to hear and pick your brain yeah. about the idea and the concept and what, what's happening here. Absolutely, yeah. So, um, yeah, this is a nice, intensive six, seven month program that we've been uh, doing. And what we see here is the first co ever color changing car. <laughs> we've seen a lot of fakes, but we've, there's never really been true color change. And the technology behind this is e ink, so electronic mm. ink. It's the same technology you know from the e readers, and the Kindles. And um, we see so much potential in this technology. It's real color change, it's low energy, it's sustainable, and it's by stable and as an engineer that's amazing it's by stable you need a little bit of energy to change the color and absolutely no energy to hold a color so here it is the world's first real color changing car and besides it being a nice gimmick we see a lot of a lot of uses for this uh, technology you know i mean obviously it catches the eye um when i you know Obviously, you know, you've thought about this more than I have, but when I see this, I'm like, oh, okay, well, you know, it can be it can be white or black depending on the lighting conditions to Absolutely. absorb the light and keep the car Absolutely. cooler yep. and whatnot. Um, yep. From what I see, there's like, it may be hard to tell, but there's there's a pattern. Is is that like uh, you're sending an electric signal through it right now yeah. um, to make it kind of show off the design right now? That's what a lot of people think, um, but no, these are actually necessary to get this quite stiff cardboardy material onto a 3D shape. So that was one of the main challenges we had here. And so we need these laser cut patterns to form such a material onto the car. So we use what's called generative design to really much make a material that has lots of springs, lots of compression elements so we can form it on our car, which is very 3D. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's do this. Let's walk around to the front yeah, of the car because yeah, I think no when you see a car, we'll take our time. Our crew is going to be coming with us, so yes. be careful, everybody. Yep. Um, but what I love about this is like when you when you see a car, yep. you've got to see the front of the car. and. I think there's just some amazing detail here. You have yeah. the striping yeah. and the lines on the hood. Um, yeah. When you're designing this, are you, when you guys are wrapping this car, are you yeah. also like thinking thinking of that, right? Absolutely. How to kind of enhance Absolutely. how it looks? Absolutely, like the the, the, the kidney grills are our icon. We, actually, the original idea is that we would start from there and then swipe to the back of the car. When you say, so, you mean here up in the, yeah, exactly. for those grills, start, right? Absolutely, yeah. And then we'd swipe to the back of the car. And of course, every every segment here is plan so that we have the effects that we that we wanted to achieve. Is the idea here um, right now I know it's 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 kind of looks like it's pulsing, right? Yeah. And yeah. so are you programming that at the moment? Um yeah. you know, right you guys had yeah. kind of built a software that talks yeah. to it to give yeah. to show up this amazing design. Yeah. Um let's say let's put you know this is a demo and it's obviously showcases this what if we're talking about, let's say, real world use, right? Yeah. Um, would yeah. someone need to like send a charge through it to change the color, or what, how do you guys envision that? Yeah, we would, uh, oh, theoretically, one could program it themselves, right? But uh, I guess realistically, we would predefine what we think the customer wants, or the customer tells us what they want, or they just program it themselves. So um, I, I guess the racing stripes is a, is a nice thing. Uh, buy colors totally in, that you know, the top's white, the bottom's black, that's also something we can do. So design on demand, we can do. Design depending on how you feel on a certain day we can do um, and also useful information like uh, battery charging status we can show that on the exterior of a car <laughs> right or if you've lost your car in a parking lot we hold make the whole thing flash and then oh you can see God. it right this is amazing yeah. so yeah. this is just an amazing you know not like this hits all the the beats that you want to see at Kino right yeah it's eye candy yeah. it's attention grabbing yeah. and it's tech yeah, yeah. And and it's on a car like, and we know like there's there's so much mobile tech coming here at CS. So everyone, whether you're at home or whether you're here, enjoy. I mean I can't keep my eyes off this thing. This is amazing. Thank, thank you so you much, so, Dr. Stella. Thank you so much. We appreciate Brian. it. Alright, there you go, the BMW iX Flow.